Hey, in another video, my colleague Druvis explains how to set up detailed logging to help with debugging certain situations. Logs can help you show more information about what is happening with a certain application and can help you to find cause for a problem. However, if you suspect that the issue is not caused by configuration, but by a software or hardware problem, you can make a supout.riff file and send it to Microtix support for analysis. This is how you can make the file. In your router, click on the make supout.riff button. Now click and download it to your computer. The supout.riff is a file that is a snapshot of your router and includes not only the logs, like you see uh, them in the log section, but also your configuration export, printouts from most common menus, and program crash information. If you are creating the file to show us some kind of problem, please make the file right at the moment when the issue is taking place, not at some other time. And only send us such files when you have a suspicion that the issue is caused by a software or hardware issue not to ask for configuration advice. If you have a suspicion about a bug in the software, what can also be useful is to reduce your configuration to a minimum, while the issue is still repeating itself. It will help us to find your problem quicker if there is no unrelated configuration in the file. If the connection to your device is slow or unreliable during the problem, you can create the file while connected over serial console. Uh, also, the file could take a long time to be created. Be patient and wait until it's fully generated. Sometimes this file is created automatically and you might find a auto sopout.riff in your files menu. This usually happens if a program has crashed in your router. Don't automatically send us these files without some additional information, like when specifically was the file created and if you can reliably repeat the situation. What is great is that you can even look at the file yourself. All you need is a Microtik account. Log in. Scroll to the section soupout.riff viewer. Here you can upload even several such files and compare them. As you can see yourself, the file is not some time machine to your router. It only has outputs of menus and some crash data, but we can't see traffic data or sniff packets. Microtik support will need some detailed context about the situation when you made the file and maybe even several files to compare. Okay, I hope this clears up your questions about riff files.